Um, this is a love song for slightly less bitterness. <laughs> um, although, if you listen to the last verse, you may not be so sure. Um, rolling in the dew makes the milk age fair. Now, before we do that, I'd just like to say that, in fact, they've done incredibly well. They're not just singing, they've learned these songs off by heart. Yeah. So that is terrific. Great. <laughs> You'd go and you'd hear a choir and they've got the words and, you know, fair enough. But the, the whole point of this song was that we, this project is that we taught the songs um, in the oral tradition so that they actually, you know, can pass them on and sing them at any time. So, uh, yes, it's quite a feat, actually. Quite a small feat. So, this is a uh, quite a nice dialogue as you'll see, men with the women always acting coy. <laughs> 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 on the interminable relationship between men and women. In a positive <laughs> way. In a positive <laughs> way. Part of his side. 
and when he awoke with a wonder, he beheld his most beautiful bride. In transporting days in the morning, his happiness now was complete. He praised his beautiful daughter, who had thus bestowed him a maze. She was not to count of his head, sir, to reign and to triumph all man. Nor was she to count of his feet, sir, by man to be trampled upon. But she was to count of his side, sir, his equal and partner to be. And as they united in one, sir, the man is the top of the tree. So let not the fair be despised by man as she's part of himself. For woman by Adam was prized more than the whole world full of wealth. Man without woman's a beggar, suppose the whole world he possessed. Hornfair song, and um, this was a fair held um, every July, and it was famous for its licentious and boisterous nature. So, if you ever wondered where the expression "horny" came from, now you know. <laughs> and and there's a description by Daniel Defoe who visited a similar fair in Kent. And literally, they go. They would have horns on their heads at the fair, um, and it's the sort of thing alluded to uh, in uh, in Shakespeare, of course. Uh, the fair, sadly, was suppressed sometime in the early 19th century, and then resurrected in 1864 as a cricket match. <laughs> very, very Victorian answer to popular culture, and the cricket match still continues. You can go there since 25th of July every year, uh, and the only thing that has any connection with the old fair is that they roast a horn sheep throughout the cricket match, and then the horns are presented to the player who, who scored the most runs. So, but that's, this song isn't about cricket though. Actually, so. <laughs> One, two, three. As I was a walking one fine summer morn, so soft was the wind and the waves on the corn. I met a pretty damsel upon a grey mare, and she was a riding along to Horn Fair. Now take me up behind you, fair maid, for to ride. Oh no, and then no, no. Table, which is why the verses are short and the chorus is long. <laughs> <laughs> 
So you can people join in if you like. Oh yes, do join in. Do join in. I'm sure you know. It's very, very easy course. <laughs> Here's a health to your jolly backs with the best of all bells. Who works at his anvil while the boy blows the bells? Which makes his bright hammer to rise and to fall. To the old cold and the young cold and the old cold of all. Twanky dillo, twanky dillo, twanky dillo, 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 dillo. And a pair of roaring magpies made from the green willow. If a gentleman calls with his horse to be shoes, he'll make no denial to one pot or two, which makes his bright hammer to rise and to fall. To the old coal and the young coal and the old coal of all. Swanky dillo, swanky dillo, swanky dillo, 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 dillo. And a pair of roaring magpies made from the green willow. Here's a health to the pretty girl, the one I love best. Who kindles a fire all in my own breast Which makes his bright hammer to rise and to fall To the old coal and the young coal and the old coal of all Swanky dillo, swanky dillo, swanky dillo, 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 dillo And a pair of roaring magpies made from the green willow. Here's a help to our king, and likewise our queen, and to all the royal family.